This is Ken Boyd, the owner of St. Louis Test Prep. Here's our website, stltest.net, the homepage, the accounting books, and also links to all of our videos here at the bottom of the page, and tutoring services. So what I wanted to do was to finish up a video that I had started, Advanced Accounting 13B, and what we saw on part one was an explanation of how we calculated a differential on the first tab, how we use the information from the differential to create adjusting journal entries, and finally, how those elimination entries got posted and we came up with consolidated financials. Now we go on and we have to do year two. And the difference with year two is, is that we're given income statement information. So Piano is the buyer, Steinway is the subsidiary, as you can see. And we're given in the problem revenue and expenses for Steinway, for Piano, the parent. And we're given revenue and expenses for Steinway, the sub. Now, what's important to get out of this is we need the net income from the sub and we need the dividends that are declared. There's a reconciliation here where I come up with the new retained earnings number because I had to roll forward from the prior year, 1231.9, to the current year, 1231.2010. I'm going to make a correction there. So what, we, what I do down here is I take the net income and the dividends, understanding that Piano, the parent, owns 80% and the non-controlling interest owns 20%. And what I set up here is, here's the subsidiary, net income and dividends. Here's the 80% of each that goes to Piano. The remaining 20% that goes to the non-controlling interest, and then I add that across. We've got to post some journal entries based on that information. So we have a dividend receivable, which reduces the investment in Steinway account for the parent because we're using the equity method. Which So we reduce the investment in Steinway for the amount of the dividend, the equity method assumes that dividends get subtracted from your investment account and your share of net income increases the investment account. So step two is, you can see first of all that the dividend came from up above 80% of the total dividend of $40,000. Down here, the parent piano gets 80% of the $60,000 in net income, or $48,000, that increases the investment in Steinway, which is an asset account, and it creates income from Steinway that goes to Piano's retained earnings. So that's how we handle, under the equity method, the parent piano share, of, I'm going to make a correction here, piano share, the parent of the subsidiary's earnings. So I handled the parent right here, piano, I do the same thing with the sub at the bottom down here. The sub has dividend receivable and reduces their investment for their share of the dividend. The sub increases their investment in Steinway, recognizes income for their share of net income. I do a little reconciliation here for the non-controlling interest where we have a beginning balance, share of income, increases the investment account, share of the dividend, reduces the investment account, and you end up with an ending balance in the non-controlling interest books. And that's an adjusting entry that's a credit up here for the non-controlling interest, an elimination entry that's a credit for $84,000 because we exclude from the parent and subsidiary consolidated numbers the value of the non-controlling interest, which in this case is $84,000. So then we post one big elimination entry to wrap this up. We take the common stock and the retained earnings for the parent for the sub, Steinway, completely off the books. So we reduce those accounts by debiting. We take the investment in Steinway account, which has now been adjusted for the parent, Piano, and we remove that in consolidation by crediting. We credit the asset to remove it. 
We credit the non-controlling interest. There's that 84,000, which I put in the T account up above, right here. And finally, you'll notice that we have a balanced entry here. We take off the equity, we remove the investment accounts for both the parent and the sub, and we have a difference of 252,400. So 